Good morning. It's now 6:15 here on your Wednesday, August 15th. Today, a local man is celebrating 20 years of giving away food to some people who need it most. KSN News reporter James Ryan is live in East Topeka right now to explain how this one man is showing us you don't have to have a lot to give back. Brittany, you can recognize Bill Ebertine by the converted school bus he drives around in, handing out free meals to people across the community. Now, for the last four months, he's been coming down to Ripley Park because he says that God told him to start preaching to the people in this neighborhood. Now, despite being on a fixed income himself, William hands out hundreds of burgers, hot dogs, and bags of frozen chicken that were donated by people that believe in his cause. Everybody has to eat. They're hungry, uh, and a lot of people are uh, that uh, are on food stamps at the end of the month. They usually uh, have it where you run out of food about a week prior to that. Although he started out by himself, now Bill has a handful of faithful volunteers that help him out during each stop, and people that donate thousands of pounds of food for his mission. Uh, Bill says that it, this all started back in 1998, so 20 years ago, when he uh, came across a man who do ended up donating hundreds of loaves of bread to him. He actually ended up putting those loaves in the back of his truck and just in one of these neighborhoods parking, putting up a little uh, cardboard sign that said free loaves of bread or free bread and just handing them out to people that he saw. And of course, as you saw, it has grown so much since then. Now, Bill himself is moving to Colorado later this year, but he does have a very faithful group of volunteers that he says are going to make sure that his mission and what the work that he's been doing here in Topeka uh, doesn't leave with him. Live in East Topeka. James Ryan, KSNT News. Well, we will miss Bill, but we thank all of the group for uh, making a difference and bettering the lives of people here in Topeka. Thank you, James, for those details. Bill and the rest of his volunteers will be in Ripley Park on Saturday from noon to 5 to give away food.